and welcome to another video. So, here, here this is. This is the big kahuna, the, U, the UCS Millennium Falcon. That's the number one from, I think, 2015, 2016. And I'll be showing you the features and, like, how it's good in comparison to that. Alright, so first, well, let's check out the minifigures. So first we have, like, the little K-Bat thingy that, like, goes, it, you grab, you just grab it, like, you can pretend it, like, sticks to the thing, like, that. There we go. Alright, and, then you got two Porgs, because from the, it can go from the newer movie and all the other older movies. So you got two Porgs. You got BB-8. You can style this, like always. You got Finn, with his normal black blaster. But the normal fin. You got Chewie, which comes with the new bowcaster that you can like it's like a stud shooter, you can like where is he? There he is. You can shoot him, like Pew. And it's all the way over there. I'll show you it. Like it's right there. So and see I think can shoot really far. Then you got Ray. Which has her gray pistol, silver pistol, from the, the new movie. You got you got Han Solo with his normal black pistol. You got Princess Leia who doesn't have a weapon, but she's got like a little white jumpsuit thingy. And you got Han Solo with his normal pistol, and he's got this really stylish hair. And you got. C-3PO, which is actually my first C-3PO. Alright. So now up to the big ship and the little ship. Big me and mini me. You got this. The, you got the, like, the two thingies. The two little solar panel thingies. You got the old movie one and the new movie one. Right there. And you got... And the other the small ship, you, have, you only have the new movie one because it's a new movie, not the old movie. And then over here, you got this thing which you can pull up. This is supposed to do this. And you can look in there. And boom, you got the little, little gunner seat which you can like put in like Han Solo. Like that. And then boom, you got Han Solo. See, I hook up the gun there, and you can put this up over him. And boom. Don't know if you guys can see on there. Like you can. But then you got the little gun on it. I can look up, down, and look to the side. Side, side. There you go. Alright. Now to this one, though. I mean, over here. You got this. It goes up, down, side, side, like always. But you can't open it up. Actually, yes, you can. Yeah. I forgot this one. Yes, you can. And you can pull this thing up. And then you can go over here. Put, like, Chewy in it. Because why not have Chewy in it? Let's take a little past. There you go. Now we got him. So you got a little stuffy nose. And you can put him in there. Oh, run like that way. Oops. So you're gonna go on the gunner sheet, there you go. And you can close the door on them, and then boom. Basically, it's controlling it. And there's like a little small window right there for them. And uh, there you go. Now, for like the, the cockpit, this has got like a really small cockpit that can only hold like two people. This has got like a little bigger, more amped up version, which can only hold like four people on it. I don't want to open them up because this would, they're both really hard to open up. But then, let's go on to the inside. I'll open them both up and I'll come back. Alright, so now they're both opened up. So I'll start with this one. Inside. So this one, you got like the little hologram chest table right here. And then you also got so the control panel right here. You control like this stuff. And you got all the gas valve system. And then, see so ya. Yeah. And then if you go over to this one's area. You got this. Yep, they're a little hologram coffee too, which is really small. And then you also got the seats. There's some seats you got like 
all three of them. And this one sheets, you got like two of them. But then if you go over to this area, you got over here, which is like, it looks like two beds. I don't know why they have beds over here, but they do. And they also got the hybridized system. Over here is with the storage. And this is like, this does start there. I put a little backpack in there, because why not? And then, oh, they have their little control area right here. And over this area's control system. This area's area. You got a cell hybrid drive, like, right in there. You got the little harness area. Han, Han, and Leia kissing area. area. And you got this, like, little, I think this is the little, um, I don't know what that's supposed to be. But then, over here, you can open this thing up. And you got this area, which is where, like, um, Ray and Ben hide in, in the movie. And then, see, yeah, that's basically the interior. And if you go around, you can see over here, hi, look how thick this is, and it's compared to this one's area. Yeah. yeah. Um, it's basically... And if you come over here, there's like a little ramp on, wait, no, not on the other side, this side. There's a little ramp on this side. Actually, wrong side. Go to, go to this side. Wait, this one. And if you can pull this down, oh my gosh, what what side is it? Okay, this is the side I was right the first time. You can pull on the ramp. If you see in there, that's right, right there. And you can pull, pull down that, so that's pretty cool. Pull it back up. And then, you go over here. Then you see the size difference right there. It's right there. It's super teensy. And then if you actually look at these, these are like really big. That's re these are my favorite part of it. Look how big those things are. They're so cool. And then if you got over here, you got like the best part of you see is that the plaque. Wait, they can read it off of that. You sorry if I butchered the name because I'm not really good at but not reading names. Alright. First thing we got Corillian Alright. Star Wars, Millennium Falcon, Corillian Light Freighter, YT1300 series. Modified by Han Solo. Manufactured, Corellian Engineering Corporation. Length, 34.75 meters. Engines, Gorodine SRB42 sublight drives. Maximum speed, 1,050 1, km per hour in atmosphere. Hyperdrive system, class 0 0.5 ISU SIM SSPO5 hyperdrive. Weapons, 2 CEC. CEC AG 2G quad laser cannons. One Blast Tech X 108 ground buzzer blaster cannon. Two Arachid ST2 concussion missile tubes. Uh, capacity two pilots, six passengers, and one metric tons of cargo. So, yeah, in 100 metric tons, that's why I call a crap ton of cargo. And if you look on it, there's like a little Million Falcon right there, pretty darn cool looking. And then here, and over here, you got the insanely large little notebook thing. Oh, I can instruct your manual. Look, look at that. See how much pages it is. It's about there's like all the stuff you can do, like how to hold it, how to hold it, how not to hold it. And you got over here, Ray and Finn going into like the little hatch. Give me an open that that bit, which is the bit right there on the very top, right there. And over here, this is on the layer right there, kissing and like the little hyperdrive area. So the lighting is like really light in there. And then over here, you got the little little thingy where you can switch out from the 
uh, old Atari one to the new Atari one. And then you're gonna go on up the ramp it, away from the little cable thing. So yeah, and this thing is exactly... 1,378 steps. And then you got like a good picture of that thing with the every, other people next to it. Then we don't have RTD2. Kind of weird. We don't have it. You got all the pieces. There's your little line in the front. And you got the little cool little mini back and logo on the back. So yeah, and here's like a little. Here's a little like extra thing because I got, I got another Lego set, but it's not like. Good enough to be its not big enough or good enough to be its own. Alright, so this is like the little ray brick heads. It's not the best to compare to me. Like don't know why it's ears. Like it looks like it's like it's like a, it's like a little goblin because like the little ear bricks like stick out so far. And it's got like a really teensy lightsaber compared to it. Because I don't know why. Like they could have just put put up a, a brick belt lightsaber. It has so many hair pieces. Like it's really weird. And also, one thing it looks like if you like look at it from this angle, um, it looks like it has it's bit raised bald. Don't know why, but it's weird. But it's got like that little season two thing. Okay, let me see if I can get there. There you go. This is C series two. It's like a little brick ninja right now by it. It's very cool. And then. Yeah, so this one is, it wasn't big enough to be on its own because it was like only a hundred pieces. But it is pretty cool looking. Okay.